parents' weekend, military school. Bulldogs, eagles, and storm clouds louder. Banner bold images 20 feet high, the names of all the cadets flanking, hung on doors facing the parade ground. <coughs> Cannons ring out a 21-gun salute, shatter brilliant October air. A single leaf lets go of its branch and plummets as if shot from the sky. A slight breeze catches the leaf. It skates past saber tips, touches the broad gray back of a cadet, and tumbles to land in the wheels of a howitzer. The major passes in review, like the Pope in a jeep with a roll cage. The jeep pulls to a stop, and the major steps out, and falling leaves crunch. Sound like hollow bones grinding. Bones needed to fly. You've got to let them go, shows descending rows of sharp teeth marching. He sticks out his tongue, plucks a son, smooths baby fur, and places him on the walkway at his mother's feet. Twelve years ago, she sent him away for the first time, dressed in navy pants and plaid shirt, new crayons tucked into a pint-sized backpack. Six weeks ago, she wiped the milk from his chin and delivered him here to his new classmates, clad in khakis and crisp white shirts, confident they will always find work. The major smiles. A single blood-red maple leaf tumbles in the gutter with a rope square off in March. In fall, leaves lose their green and reveal true colors. The last shot echoes up the mountain. The ski trail shaved clean, a new message scrawled in toilet paper. I want to wipe it away. Plant new trees like the potted ones we passed on the nursery on the drive here. Gold and yellow birch and the oak still holding on to green. The last leaves to turn. Leaves that cling through winter. Wait for spring. Twenty-one brass casings lie scattered on the ground. Poverty, homelessness, thirst, corporate greed, racism, sexism, apathy, despair, fear. There are wars to be fought, but not here. I want to say stop, but you can't stop leaves from falling. I want to scream stop. It's not too late to teach them to wage peace. <laughs>